Okay, so excuse my hair, but today we are going to go look at apartments. Um, so I'm planning on moving after my lease is almost up for my current apartment, and I was planning on moving because you know it's a nice apartment and everything, but I just feel like for the amount that I'm paying, I should be getting more. Um, so I'm about to head to my first apartment. Um, it is 1:39. My tour is scheduled at two. So I'm about to go ahead and head there, and when I get there, I will come back to you. Good morning, guys. It is currently 5.31. Um, well, 5.32 now. I'm getting ready for clinical as you can see I have my all white on y'all we're looking like some Mr. Clean baddies like period but yeah today is just clinical orientation so it's still 12 hours long I'm, I'm not super tired because your girl did go to bed early and on time last night got the little slick back kind of ponytail thing going on ponytail ain't curly because I blow dry my hair but yeah, I'm out ahead of the clinical. We have to be there by 6. Luckily, I only live like 3 minutes from my clinical site. So that is a plus for me. Um, I've already went my breakfast. Got my water together. I packed my bag last night. And the tail feezy. It's my favorite tail feezy, y'all. Like, if you know me, you know, that's the color I be carrying around the most. Because it's just so convenient. Um, but yeah. So, I'm about to go ahead and head to clinical and I will talk to you when I get there. Okay, actually you guys, I'm sitting in my car for a little bit. 537. It is so much ice on my windshield. Well, like, not ice, but like, you know, it's whatever, it's ice. But, so now I'm out sitting here and waiting for it to warm up. I wish my car had a remote start. It's down. That's really like a con of this car. I love this car. But, I'm saying I'm sorry, like especially like getting up early mornings like this. I need that. So just sit me here in the cold, wait for my car to heat up, that's all, and then I'm gonna start going into the site. Hey you guys, I just wanna show y'all it is literally 28 degrees out here, y'all. Like for real. It's cold. So you guys, I am walking up to clinical right now. So you guys, for clinical, we can't have any piercings, like facial piercings. You have like one set of earrings, hair bag, all white shoes, <laughs> name tag, all that good stuff. You guys, we are here at clinical. Just waiting on our clinical instructor. I'm eating breakfast. And all my friends are here. Everybody's here. No, I wasn't with you, but the thing he was like, the place. Place. so I'm going to show you guys what I can. But I don't know about the end of the day. Right she was it's like, going to look like this. It was like, it's going to be a good semester. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I can do. So, so you guys, we are super stressed. We're going to lunch right now. But we have to be careful. I'm stressed. I'm stressed. It's the stress, y'all. I can't do this. This is the first day. We have like a lot of paperwork to do. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We still 
to go. Okay. But wait, seriously, are, are we supposed to do it? See, I would do so a little pop. We're supposed to turn this off on code blue. No, I guess we're gonna do it on mock. It's just whatever we can do. Okay, because I was like, uh, yeah, so no fair. Ah. Yeah, my ass. I'll put it in the middle. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> So you guys, I am leaving clinical. Oh, it is currently almost six o'clock. Been here for twelve hours. Like it's terrible. But yeah, I've been here for twelve hours, you guys. So tired. It's currently 5.53. I thought it was his clock, but whatever. It's close to his clock. But this today was just so long. Like, it was a good day. A good productive day. Really learned a lot. So, I'm not complaining too much. Um, I think I'm going to like this unit. But I don't know how much I'm going to like this rotation. Um, uh, it's just not where I want to go into it, I think. But, yeah. Clinical is very long today, like for real, it was very long. But I did have fun with my classmates, they made it more interesting. I'm about to head home, I might get something to eat, but I really don't know because I'm not really hungry right now. So I might just go home and like door dash something later or either cook something in the stove or whatever. Yeah. So y'all, it is currently 2.38 in the morning. Um, I came home from clinical and I was just chilling for real. Well actually, I cleaned up um, my apartment after I got home because once things in my apartment get like a little too cluttered for me or like I just feel like things are out of place and too messy for me. It just irritates my soul and I just gotta fix it so I went through my whole apartment and I meant to film it but I was just in my mood like in my mode cleaning like getting everything straight so I went in and did that and then afterwards I was chilling watching YouTube for a couple hours um you know just looking at other black girl youtubers you know trying to get some inspiration get some advice and also what I wanted to show y'all is my devotion book that I got. Wait for the focus. But this is all uh, my devotion book. Um, it's written by Joyce Myers. It is strength for each day. So in this book, it has 365 devotions to make every day a great day. I felt like I needed this in my life right now because school is just really getting hard. And this past semester, um, I actually failed a course by three points. And it, it really like devastated me. It did something to me. I felt very discouraged. Um, I just really wanted to give up, honestly. Um, I felt like I had a very troubling semester last semester. I was like going through things. It's just trying to get in the motion of school. Um, everything was just getting in, you know. Everything was basically just trying to find the right order. Trying to like prioritize and get things on a schedule. Basically what I'm trying to say. Could get my schedule together, girl. So yeah, so I just really wanted that. Um, this book, my classmate really put me on. Shout out to you, Nia. Um, she uses her devotion book to help her with school, like give her motivation for school, like especially like before our exams. Um, so in this book, it has like little sayings at the top about like, so basically like a title to show like, for something you're going through like it says for example this page says when life hurts i don't know if y'all can see it i'm gonna try to focus but this one says when life hurts um so after it has the title then you have um 
basically the scripture that it comes from of the Bible. Um, and then it has like a little paragraph basically explaining everything. And so I haven't actually read one yet because I just got it. I'm actually going to read one tonight. So if you guys want one of these i got mine from amazon i really recommend it though i've heard great things about it so i feel like it's gonna make a positive impact on my life so go ahead and check out these you don't have to get the specific one but i got mine off of amazon there are plenty out there i just you know looked through reviews and found one that i felt like matched me the most so that's what I did. And the other thing that I wanted to show y'all was this book that I got. And it says Positive Affirmations for Black Women. Um, I felt like I need this because I feel like us black women are very underrated. Like, we are some powerful, powerful women. Like, not knocking other races. Women in general are just so strong. Like, women women rule this world for real yeah we really do but i just feel like women of color i wanted some positive words for us for us sisters you know what i mean the sisters <laughs> but yeah so this book has like pictures in it and for example it has it says like confidence so below it has affirmations to like say to yourself to make you feel confident so for example i'm gonna read one this one says i am powerful melanated and capable of running my world so i just feel like reading like two or three of these a day are really gonna increase my self confidence uh, which i kind of lack like you didn't prove it up on that but I just have some areas that I feel like I need to improve on on myself. So I feel like these two books really help me. I also got that one off Amazon. It is not expensive at all. I think it was like 11 or $12. Same for my devotion book. I think it was like maybe like 12 13 Don't quote me. But I will try to link the um, URL and everything in the comments. So you guys can get these exact ones if you like these exact ones. But yeah, I, just, I really just want to show y'all that. So I'm probably like a little bed. Um, it's 2.45 in the morning. I've literally been up since, let's see. Clinical started at 6 this morning. Basically yesterday morning. I got up at like 5. So we pushing like 23, 24 hours. Of being up and I'm not sleepy that's the crazy thing like I think it's because I went to bed early last night like so I'm like totally energized and I had coffee today during clinical so I feel like it's just really kicking in right now because it did not kick in what I needed to kick in like I was so tired but I feel like I'm up so I'm probably about to watch some more YouTube probably about to watch TikTok chill over my little toes together y'all just chill because tomorrow I plan on studying because i have a test coming up in my nursing class or one of my nurse class um and i also plan on like go ahead and start working on this upcoming week's assignments just because i i do plan on going back home this week and i know once i get home it's like different when you go home i feel like your focus is more like when covid was going on they shut down campuses y'all at home Luckily, I wasn't in, like, my major classes. I was just taking pre -rec. I still did good in my classes, y'all. But my focus was not there at all. Like, I was just getting through the pre -recs. Like, so I'm glad that I am, like, here on campus away from home just to have my focus on school. Because up here, it's like, you don't have none of your friends from back home up here. Especially with me being out of state, y'all. You don't have none of your friends up here. And... I just feel like when you don't really have nothing to do because you ain't got nobody to hang out with really. I mean, I got friends up here, trust me. I do, I got friends up here. But I don't go out. I'm, I like to stay home and chill. I'm a homebody, basically. 
your girl's a homebody. So yeah, when you don't have nothing to do for real, y'all, all you can do is like do your work or either go to sleep. That's all you can do. Or either watch TV. Like it's nothing to do. Like that's why I'm glad I got my dogs up here. They be chilling with me. No lie though. Like I be talking to them. I be talking to my dogs. But they can't talk back. Right? Like, they talk back. It's a problem. So that's a good thing. But it's um, we just be chilling. Like it's it's very peaceful though. Very peaceful. But I think like that it do get boring a little bit though. Anyway, I just make it work. Focus on my books. Um, of course, I do miss my baby. Like, I have a big help from my parents. Shout out to them. Shout out to Nobody's grandparents for helping me. Um, I have the positivity. I have the support from a lot of people, a lot of family members, just to go ahead and finish my degree. So I have a lot of help from my son. Um, and it's, it was challenging, but we'll get there. I feel like the end goal, I always try to get motivated by remembering my end goal, basically. I get discouraged a lot of times just because I'm not physically like with my son every day, but I always remember the end goal. Guys, I just cooked. Um, I made some like hot honey lemon pepper chicken tenders. And it's definitely giving Chick-fil-A. And I made some homemade mac. Like, do not play with your girl for real. And I am currently watching Jada Jone. I love her. So shout out to you, girl. Love her vlogs. Yes. Why is my camera going that far? <laughs> But yeah, I'm watching Jada Jonay. Love her. So yes, that's what we're doing. About to eat. Yeah, oh, like yesterday, because I live in Yesterday, um, drinking my Yeah, I haven't been doing nothing all day. Just chilling, so I'm probably up all night, and I'm probably gonna study all night. So, yeah. so guys, I am about to go to my study session. It's currently like 3:36. Study session started at three. I am late, y'all, because I had to finish my care plan, which was due by 5 p.m. today. Um, I stayed up late last night. I was supposed to finish it last night for real, but I was really tired. It was like two something in the morning like you know taking a nap yesterday which i didn't wake up from till like 7 p.m no i woke up like around eight i think or whatever and then i made dinner and that didn't finish till like 11. so yeah as you can see my schedule is like really messed up sleep schedule is terrible i need to get back in track so yeah i might go ahead and head that way to the campus Running behind, I gotta take my trash out. I got like three bags of trash sitting in here, y'all. Like, that's the only thing I hate. But I wish we had valet trash service. Like, you just sit out your door and then take it. But no, we don't got that. You gotta take it yourself. Especially, like, with it just being me. Like, I'm a woman. Like, I gotta do all that. <laughs> for real, for real. But yeah, I'm gonna head that way, y'all. And I will see y'all guys. Hey, guys. I am on campus. I just woke. It's killing me for real, for real. But yeah, college girl. I'll show you how. So, guys, this is our clock tower. As you can see, Let's see if it focus. guess not but I'm going to the library which is right here what's up y'all I'm Ashley I'm Janaya's friend I'm her nurse one of her nurse babies and right. her nurse okay, so we know that now what causes and right now we're coming 
study session. Um, last of course, we got to retake this test. We don't pass this test. Thiazide. Thiazide. If it ends in I, thiazide. That's our, that's our girl Khalid in here knowing everything she's coming out. Right, potassium wasted. Thiazide is bad. Y'all can see the board. Ooh, yeah, I'm making stuff blurry. No, I thought I thought they, I thought they people called. Mental enough. That was about the mental enough. High above you. The potassium is very inside. I know if I go home, I'm um, not going to do nothing. I'm going to be lazy. Eat all the You must sometimes buy them. Yeah. Like $10. Why are you You're in it now. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Tashana. I'm single. Junior, I went to Salem State University. I've seen major adults. <laughs> play with it. <laughs> Got Kalia with the tail feezy. Tail feezy twin. By the time they coming up. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Uh, today is, is today Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, and it is eight oh seven. I'm on my way to class. Running late as usual. It's sweet it starts at eight thirty. Um, I want it to be a little earlier, but. Hey, I'm here. So that's what I'm doing now. Just getting into class, get ready to take this quiz, and I will catch you guys after class. Okay guys, so I'm back. Um, it's currently 4.58 p.m. I am on my way to take camp to get groomed at PetSmart. Mind you, his appointment is at 5 o'clock. Y'all, I cannot be on time for anything except for clinical. That's it. Like, I really gotta get better, but I just woke up from a nap. Um, face all ashy, like... I look rough, my hair needs to get done, like, but yeah, Cam right here, he chilling y'all, like, he's such a good dog, when he want to be, because baby, them boy dogs, they a different breed, like, he is so active, like, I wouldn't say he's a bad dog, but he just stay into things, so, he keeps you on your toes, for real. But yeah, we're on the way to PetSmart and I'll see you guys when we get there. Now, me and PetSmart, so we waiting because they only can have one pet family at a time. So I'm just waiting for the family in front of me to get out of there so we can go in and I can him check in and everything. Say, thank you. I really want to get one of these, you guys. 
washroom so I don't have to like refill their bowl like every day. Just me being lazy. Ooh. But they expensive, like $34.99. Amazon babes. Amazon. So I just dropped camp out. It's currently 517. He should probably be done around 8, 815 ish. So right now I'm probably about to go home and study look at the lecture that we went over today in class but first i gotta get something to eat as always like your girl love to eat like i'm hungry starving so i'm about to grab chick-fil-a chick-fil-a is really like literally right over there so i'm probably about to head over there but the only thing is y'all i hate how like this entrance is made i'm gonna go window down so y'all can see like it is so hard to get out of here like it's like cars be back all the way up where that civil car just went to cars usually be backed up blocking the um entranceway so yeah but yeah probably about to head over there get some food then i'm gonna go home and sit me yeah we finna work out get this summer body period my legs up yeah. i like this And you're pretty much gonna be like tightening your core uh -huh. in the midst of it. Right. I just finished my workout and I am on the way to pick up camp because they just called me and let me know that he is ready. It's currently 7.33. I am out of breath. Ooh, I just hit myself. I am out of breath and yeah, if I get him, I'm going to go home and study my lecture for real because I didn't end up going to Chick-fil-A. I just warmed up, warmed up some pizza rolls, so yeah. I got camp. No, no, so I got camp. And he is so cute, hey. He is so cute. Say hey, everybody. Foot camp. <laughs> hey, you told me you were gonna wait. Wait for him to tell you. Here, I'm here. Okay. Do you know that you guys have hit me already? No, Is that normal? So y'all, I'm back in North Carolina. It is currently Friday, February 3rd. Um, I'm about to go to the hospital to pick up my clinical assignment for clinicals tomorrow. Um, I'm printing out my med sheets and my care plan right now. Don't mind my hair. I'm gonna have like a little self care vlog coming for y'all soon, or real soon. Cause your girl look down bad, but it's okay. Cause my bills paid <laughs> but yeah so i'm about to head to the hospital and i will talk to you guys either when i get there or when i get back because i'm not sure like if i'm able to record or not so yeah hey guys so it is sunday um it is currently 10 37 at night right now i am studying for my test on tuesday like y'all i literally have a test every week like okay one week we have a test and then the next week we have a retake for that test next week the next test and i also picked up a public health class on top of my nursing classes so your girl is busy for real for real y'all can see the white stuff in my hair it's gel don't mind it i got some um detangler in my hair because I'm supposed to get my hair braided Tuesday so I got it sitting in my hair I'm gonna wash my hair tomorrow and everything I'm supposed to have a study session tomorrow at 3 so I'm gonna try to have all of that done by 
tomorrow before I go. So I'm trying to get up early, but it depends on what time I'm going to be at night. Because I slept all day today, y'all. Like, for real. I slept all day. Did not mean to. I want to be productive. But I still woke up and was productive. I have washed all my clothes and everything. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> um, <laughs> I've got some souvenir bikes from Taco Bell. These are the best things from Taco Bell for y'all. I don't even like Taco Bell. I don't do all that quesadilla stuff and all that taco, none of that. Just give me those. Just give me those cinnamon things. I think that's what they call cinnamon. Give me those. I'm good. I had originally ordered pies, y'all. But my dasher got there and they talking about their clothes. Like, excuse me, ma'am. So I'm like, y'all don't need my money back. And she was like, well, you have to request it back. So I canceled my order for them, but I don't see my money coming back in my account. So I'm going to call them tomorrow and get my money back because I need my money. Here. But yeah, I'm just sitting here studying. I am going to close off this vlog here. I will have another video coming out soon to you guys. Like I said, I am going to try to do a self-care vlog, especially like when we get my hair done soon. Your girl got her eyebrows done already, and they look real good. But I'm going to try to do like a little self-care vlog, because right now I'm doing the weekly vlogs, but I'm trying to do like more than just that. So yeah. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I will see you guys next time, and don't forget to like.